Hey guys, welcome back in CodeSphere. So today in this video, I'm going to show you that how can we improve this ExoPlayer UI. So here you can see that we have this custom ExoPlayer layout file. And here you can see that this is a current timer and that is a total duration and this is a play button and video is streaming now. See, this is a pause button and you can pause it. You can play it again, again, pause it. And here you can see that this is an image, understand? And this is a video. Both are streaming in the same layout file here as you can see that this is a single and same layout file but we are retrieving both images and videos together and here you can see that there is a button for creating other post and uh, so today in this tutorial I'm going to show you that how you can do this so without wasting time let's start. So guys first of all here what we'll do is that uh, as I said that in this video we will improve the UI. So first of all we will create a layout resource file and that will be for uh, custom exo player. Understand? Click on this layout then new layout resource file and its name will be custom underscore exo player enter and after this guys you can see that we have this very basic layout file understand here we need to do some changes and then it will be fine so first of all give the background that will be android transparent layout direction not caps small play out direction that will be ltr and uh, you need to make height wrap content yes so wrap content then orientation vertical after this we can proceed here understand so now guys here you can see that uh, first of all we'll use a linear layout and uh, then it will be match parent wrap content match parent width wrap content height and after this we will give the id that will be which is not required that much yeah you can write gravity center vertical so we just want to keep all our controls in the center vertically orientation will be horizontal as I said, right ignore, not yet. Just close this one. Now we can not like this, like this. Understand? So after this, inside this linear layout, we'll use the controls that we want to implement in our exo player. Understand? So first of all, here we will write image button. And uh, then guys, you know, here all we need is just to delete it. And uh, we will write the ID only because it is already predefined so we don't need to write uh, a lot of stuff it will work exo play as you can see that it is already predicting it so after this you have to write the style and that will be exo button play exo button dot play understand and layout width will be layout width 60 dp understand and then simply close it after this you need to copy this uh, image button control plus c and then after this guys you have to just paste it again and this time we will make it pause because uh, this is for play and obviously when you have, when we are playing a video so we need to pause it again so now we will pause that understand after this we will use a uh, text view and that will be for position yeah so right uh, remove this attributes yes so here you can remove this height width right id that will be exo position it will automatically suggest you see exo position yeah and after this you have to write the width wrap content that will be sorry layout width Play out that is wrap content and uh, height also play out height as you can see that it is saying required yeah because it is required and uh, then after this include font padding <coughs> include font padding that will be true sorry false and then after this padding left 4 dp padding left 4 dp padding right 4 dp padding right 4 dp 
and then after this text color you can say text color should be uh, you can give uh, white color for now we can give yeah text color should be color start this way yeah so it will be better color red after this you can proceed so text size that is going to be it's a very simple not text scale x text size and that is going to be 10 sp 10 sp will be fine and text style will be normal so i will give normal so now we can see that we are complete with this text view after this guys here we just need to retrieve the default timer that is provided by the exo player library so simply write uh, default time bar here you can see that it is already showing so width will be 0 dp and uh, height will be 26 dp 26 dp and then after this uh, yes we have to give the id because that is how we can implement it so write exo progress it will automatically show you you can see exo progress then blade color and uh, that will be color red yeah because it will look beautiful that's why and most importantly layout weight you have to give uh, one and close it so you can see that uh, now our default timer time bar is also completed almost complete so after this we need to implement a text view and that will be our last text view you know why because uh, that will be our final duration that uh, how much long the video is control plus c come below here control plus v yeah and that will be not exo position that will be exo duration as i said that we will show that how long the video is and all the childs will be same 4 dp 4 dp color red and 10 sp and everything will be same understand all you need to do is change this and uh, then i think so you need to just do uh, you know guys you just need to make this background uh, you can make it black for now yes so we can see all the controls that we are using here you can see that we can see it remove this and then click on this it is showing error red bulb add tools understand and uh, now it's complete guys as you can see and if you want to do more so you can click on it and we can fix the constant and i can i think that's okay yeah so after this guys what you have to do here is just simply come here understand and just before this uh, go here in this fragment 4 and uh, here we have given too much of uh, padding 10 dp i just need to make this uh, 2 dp i think that's okay and uh, here margin just remove this margin it is not required that much match parent yeah fine guys so after this here uh, you have to come here in this uh, click on this we will see this uh, exo player understand so we will here just add a uh, one more that uh, layout controller id i think we are already using it use controller true and uh, controller layout id and that will be at the rate custom drawable custom exo player layout custom exo player yeah so as you can see that it is uh, now working here and uh, so you can see that it's quite good so you can run the app and uh, see is it working or not so in case if you get any error then let me know in comment section i will try to reply in next 24 hours so guys as you can see that the app is running absolutely good there is no error in our android app understand so when i will open this fragment 4 so we should retrieve all the data successfully as i have shown you and you can see that this time the ui is a little bit more beautiful than the previous time understand and uh, we will check that our uh, here you can see that our custom layout controls are now visible understand so here you can see that it is quite good yeah yes as you can see that it is quite good and if you want to stream it see it's working quite good no error our custom layer controls are pretty good here you can see that because i have given this time out that's why it is just up disappearing too early but if you will inc increase this number so it will increase the timer of that controls on a screen understand 
you can see that this is showing the total duration and it is showing the progress so here you can see that now it is four seconds and uh, it is 11 see so you can see that our app is working absolutely good there are images and there are videos both are streaming together both are uploading together both are driving together everything is working absolutely good so i hope you like this tutorial so guys if you like my channel then please subscribe my channel and uh, also click on the bell icon so you will never miss any update yes guys and in future we will implement the downloading function sharing function and deleting all these photos and uh, you know for example that if you uploaded this post so only you can delete this and uh, if uh, this post is uploaded by other person so you cannot delete that post understand so we will learn a lot of good things about firebase and social media in this series so make sure to subscribe this channel and don't forget to press the bell icon so you will never miss any update thank you for watching